Responding appropriately to disclosures of sexual violence can be challenging, and as a result, young survivors' experiences vary widely. However, every adult working with young people has a responsibility to safeguard them from all forms of harm, including the long-term impacts of sexual violence. Before disclosure, make sure all young people know what constitutes sexual harm and that these behaviours will not be tolerated. Demonstrate to young people through policies and actions the disclosures of sexual harm will always be taken seriously. Build relationships with specialist agencies who can offer advice and support for staff and young survivors. At Disclosure Provide a means of reporting that allows young people to share concerns anonymously if they want to, and preferably to a specially trained member of staff or to an independent external agency. After Disclosure Involve young survivors in any decisions about them. Provide a safe, physical space for young survivors which they can access when needed. Have at least one trusted adult, preferably someone the young survivor has chosen themselves, who can check in as and when needed by the young person. Make sure the young survivor and the person who has caused them harm are supported by different adults in different spaces. Seek specialist support to learn the basics of the criminal justice process and be aware that a decision to take no further action by the police does not mean the sexual violence did not happen. Make sure support remains in place until the young survivor says they no longer require it. Ongoing support. Be mindful of changes to timetables, of teachers or around exam time Ensure support in place isn't forgotten or assumed to not be needed anymore. Young survivors are moving through challenging life transitions and responses to sexual violence may change over time. The journey to recovery can be very long and complex and closure may not be possible. Supporting young survivors to manage safely and in the best way they can should always be the priority.